Welcome to Tickle Time. This is Leia, uh, also known as Panima, the moderator of the daily tickle.wordpress.com. Uh, today I decided to show a creative way of how to wrap a tickle without using a scarf. Um, I found this shirt in my wardrobe and thought how beautiful this would be uh, as a tickle. I really like the fabric. So here's the, the back is perfect. So, I experimented and came up with a um, surprisingly successful, not too difficult, um, tickle to wrap. Um, so, quick try to show you how to do this. Um, because this is kind of a, a slippery material, I use um, straight pins to hold everything together. That makes it a little easier. So. What I did was chose the white uh, scarf as my base, so that the colors, since it's pretty see-through, um, that the colors would be brighter. Because if you use a dark color, it's going to dull the color. Uh, so just be aware, of, be aware of that. But what I did is I started with putting my head through the collar, but like this. So uh, laying that along the hairline, this part along the hairline, just kind of tucking it behind my ears, if you will. And then taking it and kind of making sure you know where the sleeves are. And you kind of want it to be in the middle. Just those sleeves you're going to want to hide in a minute here. So take it and twist it. And you're going to have the purple part hanging down in the back. Which is okay, because you're going to use the purple part as a contrast here in a minute. So, let's see if I've got it here. Sleeve number one. Feels like right here. Sleeve number two. Yes. You're going to take those. You're going to want to kind of hide them up. Because this is where the, you're going to want to hide them, so this is kind of where I put them. The straight pins to hold them both quick. Now usually I don't use those straight pins to hold them. For this so that they don't fall down while I'm trying to show you. And that's what I'll do the straight pins. But then you take the rest and probably from here, just twist what you have left. Anyway, so you mostly see just the purple because there's still a little bit left in there. And then just take pull it across the top and So, you can practice with that, it's like here you've got the button, you got to try to hide that, things like that, but for the most part it's pretty simple, an easy way, and then like, as you can see in the picture, I used a blue ribbon, so just to kind of make it look nice, jazz it up a little. yourself a really pretty tickle to wear and you didn't even have a scarf <laughs> so there you have it a tickle using a shirt well I hope it's not too difficult any questions uh, email me panima at hotmail.com that's p-e-n-i-m-a-h at hotmail.com. Any questions, concerns, suggestions, uh, we'd love to hear it. And uh, if you have any ideas to share or t-shirts that you've used or just shirts in general that you use for, uh, for a scarf, it'd be really fun to see it and put it on my blog. So, thanks for watching.